Namaste, and welcome back to our continuing journey through the Tao Te Ching. Today we continue this profound journey with Chapter 62. I hope you enjoy it. Chapter 62 The Tao holds the crux to the mire of things. It is the treasure of goodness. It is a redeemer of evilness. Articulate words can influence the economy. Respectable actions can win the hearts of the people. How can one be removed from temptation? Therefore, when the leader is chosen and the officers are appointed, though you may have treasures of honor and chariots of pride to offer, it compares not to offering a vision in the Tao. Why is the value of the Tao cherished timelessly, without asking and be given, having sinned and be forgiven? Therefore, it is cherished by the world. Wow, what a beautiful chapter. I hope you're able to hear these words again and to find the meaning that lies hidden within. Do share this with someone who you feel will benefit from joining this journey. Leave me a comment and let me know how you felt. I look forward to seeing you on our continuing journey through the Tao Te Ching. Until next time, this is Akshananda signing off from the Himalayas with much love and light. Namaste.